don't scroll away you want to watch this entire video this is exposing freemasonry in the catholic church this is an ex-freemason exposing it all and how the catholic church is tied to the freemasonic lodge watch till the end level esoteric right right and were you surprised when you found that there were more than 33 degrees no not really see here you got here's how this works when i went through the masonic rituals i had the spirit guides in my ear whispering things telling me to do things telling me to answer certain things in certain ways Demons. because i did that i was identified by the leadership of the Grand Lodge of the state of Wisconsin, that I was someone a little bit extraordinary. Prophetic. And see, that's one of the ways in which, is, in which I ultimately got contacted by the Illuminati, is because the spirit guides had given me certain key things to say, key things to do, uh, even gestures to make, stuff like that, that would identify me as being someone who was worthy of more light. But See, that's what they promise in all the Masonic degrees. They say, you know, you get light, you get further light, you get more light. And of course, where does this light come from? Listen. Well, if you read the writings of the Masonic leaders, that comes from Lucifer. And how many Masons know that? Maybe one in a thousand, uh, but most of them don't have a clue unless they bother to toddle upstairs and read the books that are in their own Masonic libraries like I did. How many Master Masons know that there are Satanists among them? I'd say the same figure I quoted earlier, one out of a thousand. Right. Since, since Catholics are strictly forbidden to be Masons, yes, why are you being asked to do two opposite things? What people don't realize is that the Catholic Church helped start the Masons. And that, for example, the Scottish Rite, most of the degrees in the Scottish Rite were written by Jesuits. So even though there wow. is this apparent antipathy between the masons and the catholics to the point that up until john paul ii's reign if you became a mason you were roman catholic you were de facto as communicated just like that um but actually it's all a sham because most of the high level of um, people in the vatican are all freemasons and many of the people that are freemasons are catholics